Here in Columbus, Ohio at the Central East Regional, we want to find out what these athletes are really like, and we're going to get the information from the people that know them best. Um, he likes to keep little scrap pieces of paper all over the house. And most of them are pertaining to workouts. Like, he'll think of something he wants to do, and he writes it down, and it's like in the kitchen. And then he'll think of another one, and it's in the bathroom. And normally, like five or six make it in the laundry, so there's like shreds of paper on everything. You know, she, uh, she picks out her headband at night, exactly what she wants to wear. She'll lay it out on the bed. You know, it'll be all pretty, color coordinated. I think that's a little strange. Like for her workout yes. um, outfit? Yes. She has three good to go for today, just in case. One, one just for kicks. What kind of toys did he play with? Usually superheroes. <laughs> like Dan Bailey? Yeah. <laughs> little, little, he had a little Dan Bailey when he was growing up. Next to Superman and Batman. Yeah, right in between. What's the most romantic thing that she's ever done for you? Oh, she cooked me a paleo pizza on Valentine's Day. Was it good? I got food poisoning the next day. <laughs> <laughs> what would cause her to use a backup instead of the main outfit? If she doesn't feel the, the colors that she's wearing, if it doesn't really give her the power that she's seeking, she will go for the backup option. What do you give her? Um, pretty much nothing, she surprised me. I was like, you gave your girlfriend of three years nothing for Valentine's Day? Well, we lived in different places, so she surprised me in Cleveland. There's, there's this thing called the mail. I'm not very good at that. We have two cats. Are they yours or his? His. They love him more. What, are, what did he name them? Uh, Gizmo and Lulu. So that's a little bit weird. You, he has a cat that he named after a character in Gremlins. Yeah, it kind of just stuck. We liked it. He likes Mary Poppins. He does. Apparently, he used to watch it all the time before we were married. Um, we don't own it now, but apparently it was gifted to him on a VHS, and he used to watch it all the time. Um, in college, he lived by himself, cheap little apartment, and he didn't have cable, but he would watch Shrek over and over again. In college? Yes. We first got married, and he would DVR Save by the Bell. Well, that I think that's pretty respectable. So what have we learned today? We know that they love fashion, Mary Poppins, and they have no idea how to cook. But we do know one thing, they can move large loads, long distances, pretty damn quick.